What's up, nerds? So for this episode, I am going to unbox and review the um, DC Collectibles uh, John Diggle uh, action figure from the show Arrow. And I know this is an older uh, action figure. It's been out for quite some time, but I did receive it as a gift from my brother. Um, and I did want it, but I just feel, I didn't feel like, um, spending $24 on a, a very plain Jane action figure. I mean, if you look at this action figure, it's just it's just a guy with a gun and, like, hands and everything. So, I mean, if you look at the other ones, like uh, the Flash or Arrow or a Green Arrow or a S Arsenal, at least they're, like, the superheroes. And this, I mean, John Diggle, he doesn't, he's not even gotten the, 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 the Spartan outfit on. It's just, it's just a guy with regular clothes on. So, I mean, I didn't want to um, spend that kind of money on this action figure, but I did receive it as a gift. Um, so, of course, I want it now. And I did want it before because I, I do like John Diggle as a character. Um, kinda. So, we'll see. But um, why don't we go ahead and dive in and take a look at this and check it out. So, uh, come along. Okay, so I'm just gonna open this up and let me just get out my X-Acto knife. So we're going to cut this. Oh, there's some more tape here. And like I said, this is an older action figure. I know that. And you've probably seen a bunch of stuff online, but I don't. I haven't had this one. I do have to say, I really do enjoy the DC Collectibles action figures. I really do think that they do such a great job with their action figures. I only have... My one and only complaint is the fact, oh shoot, that they don't come with enough accessories. Like this only, this John Diggle only comes with a gun and then two different sets of hands besides the closed fist ones that he has in this thing. And I really do wish that they had more. So I'm just going to cut, get my nippers, cut these, this part. You want to be careful when pushing it out of this plastic part because it can, it can break your action figure. And this is not coming out very well. Let's do it there for a few at first. Oh, jeez. Okay. And before we look at that, let's just pop out the gun. Okay, so we have this gun that he comes with. And then he's got, you know, he's got four different sets, or two different sets of hands besides that. Um, he's got where he can hold the gun and then, you know, what looks like just do so he could hold something else. And we'll just set that aside. So then for my, so now let's just look at this action figure. Now, if you look at it, I really do think that they, are, they do a good job with these action figures. Um, sometimes when you open them, the, uh, they can be a little rough when you bend them, so you might want to be careful, but you do want to go ahead and move all of the, uh, the points of articulation, just because that way you can get it kind of loose and everything, but you do want to be careful when doing that, but like I said before, I really do think that DC Collectibles does a great job with their action figures. I mean, this figure, even though it's just a regular guy, um, you know, uh, it still is it still is a sup superior action figure compared to um, some other ones that you might get. I really do think I think the materials that they use is are great. I think that uh, the way they sculpt their action figures is great. I think even the paint job is really good. I mean, you can't see it, but the eyes are really great. I really just think that this is this is a really good action figure. Um, I just don't think that the character is worth the money that you pay for this uh, this action figure. I think that if you're going to pay. Um, 25 to 30 dollars for an action figure you should get a superhero 
or someone that you you might really want. And Diggle is kind of a superhero in his own right, but he's not um, a character with superpowers. And I know Arrow, you're gonna be like, a Green Arrow doesn't have powers, but I mean, he kinda does with that whole Arrow thing. So I just think that this is such a great action figure. So what do you guys think of the John Diggle action figure from uh, DC Collectibles? Um, I hope you guys like this video. If you did, can you please hit that like button? If you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it. And I will check you guys later. Bye! Hey guys, if you like this, go ahead and check out my main channel at Geek What? Link in the description down below. If you want to help support me even more, you can check out my merch store, also in the link down below. Thanks so much. I really appreciate it.